Hey guys and gals, Vlad here with AVT Astro, and today, as always, I've got an interesting astro topic for you guys. We are talking about the benefits of joining your local astronomy club. Alrighty guys, so this is a really exciting weekend. My astronomy club is launching its first star party at the property that they bought, uh, which is called Star Larch. It is 10 acres in the Bend, Oregon area and about a Bortle 2 sky. And I had the pleasure of digging out my own site, as you can see, when I arrived yesterday. It was a lot of fun. Mike, what's up, man? Hey, how's it going? Did you, help it. Did you come to help me dig, man? Come on. So guys, what inspired me to make this video is the fact that, you know, these days everybody obviously is online. There's Facebook groups, there's, you know, like uh, other groups like Cloudy Nights and that type of deal for us astronomy people to kind of hang out, which is an awesome, awesome resource. But, you know, um, I feel that like astronomy clubs, they kind of don't really get the attention that they deserve. And I wanted to just kind of highlight if you're one of the people, you know, that's not a member of your local astronomy club and you know hopefully you do have an astronomy club where you live um just some of the benefits that my astronomy club offers and ch chances are is yours will as well you know the first thing of course that i will cover is star parties i mean come on guys i mean the whole th uh, aspect of getting together with a bunch of like-minded astronomy people um, and being able to observe or image whatever you're into is really awesome uh, it's one of the best ways you know if you're newer to astronomy to learn about the hobby i uh, just um you know because you're there with people that are you know uh, perhaps more experienced than you uh, you could learn new techniques new like uh you know for whether you're into astrophotography or visual um and just overall yeah just the wealth of knowledge usually at star parties of course uh if you want to be kind of more like me if you watch more videos you know you, you you know that i love trying out new astronomy gear um and you don't actually want to buy this stuff right well guess what you go to a star party and you've got you know chances are like at this star party there's probably like 20 different maybe even more different scopes that you could try out you know whether you're into visual or if you're into astrophotography you know you can kind of interact with the owner get their feedback what they think about their setup what they like about what they don't like about it and that type of deal so to kind of sum it up star parties that's kind of my personal favorite you know you get to go out to some of the darkest skies you know that are available chances are in your air wherever you live like here we're at, we're at about a Bortle 2 sky uh, like last night uh, you know this is at about 44 uh, degrees latitude so the Sagittarius was out but it's still pretty low but we had a good view of the south here which I normally don't have from home or most of my observing sites so it was really cool to check out those southern objects you know in a dark, nice dark sky site uh, kind of moving on from star parties and kind of you know like that type of deal uh, another cool thing if you're kind of into just learning generally stuff about astronomy like our, our club has meetings uh, once a month to where they'll have a guest speaker usually that talks about you know astronomy related uh, stuff you know whether it's like astrophysics or you know equipment stuff or just stuff kind of going on in astronomy so that's a really cool thing as well if you're kind of more into them kind of going off of that topic our astronomy club the rose city astronomers actually has several special interest groups ones like astrophotography there's a women's one there's one that's just for people that want to kind of get together and hang out that's called downtowners uh we also have the telescope workshop where i uh, volunteer i used to volunteer a lot more there uh, where you know we kind of help people with you know gear related issues whether it's like they don't know how to get their go-to going or their telescope's broken you know they might need help fixing it uh, so that type of deal as well um, one other cool thing that you know that i'm kind of involved with is the telescope uh, library which is um basically our club has a library of telescopes that members can borrow for free of charge uh, so you know if again if you're newer to astronomy i don't recommend you go out and you know buy your very first telescope unless you've talked to somebody that's really knowledgeable um, about it uh, tr just trying out gear like that just borrowing is a really good way to start I'd say for at least like your first six months in the hobby just get a couple of different type of scopes see what you kind of like what you you know enjoy observing or if you're in test photography 
definitely by all means get together with some people that know uh, about the topic and they'll kind of you know guide you in the right direction one other thing that my club offers is actually discount on publications like sky and telescope magazine i know for a fact i think they might do astronomy magazine as well and some other stuff you know there's some perks like that as well and if you know if you are kind of like in the market of you know finding uh like you know a new telescope or some astronomy gear usually like our club they host a swap me once a year to where you know people are selling and buying uh telescopes that's a good way to do it. but just in general like just talking to people in the club i mean you know people are always kind of like upgrading their gear or changing their gear up uh it's a really good way to you know get some gear locally you know that if you're okay buying used that uh, you know like a really good discount uh so overall guys i'd say you know like the whole internet then it's really cool like you know like all the groups that you could join on the internet uh I would highly encourage if you're not a member of your club, by all means, check it out, uh, join, you know, meet some cool new people and, uh, you know, hopefully go out to some places like this and enjoy some really dark skies again and make some new friends. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any questions, comments or anything like that, leave them to, leave a comment in the thing below. If you're an RCA member, you guys are some of the best people in the world and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.